It's the perfect place for old lessons and new arrivals to intersect in the Westchester Hospital Maternity Ward. And the latest addition to the Maternity Ward's waiting room puts the hospital's community pride on full display. The painting, which depicts the history of the Westchester Liberty area, is on a wall that didn't exactly factor into the waiting room plans. The issue was that there's a wall and that wall is that houses all the uh, um, heating, ventilation, air conditioning units, and it was an eyesore. The surroundings at Westchester Hospital can be just as important as the care a patient receives. To make the wait a little easier for expecting families, COO Tom Diskalikis first called on Matthew Daler at Higher Level Art. We, we like to say we want to put paint where it ain't at. <laughs> The mural that followed would be a complete history of the area from start to finish and even into the future with the Liberty Center development currently under construction. But Matthew couldn't come up with this history all on his own. Well, it took a lot of research because one, we're not from the Westchester area. We live down in Kentucky. Uh, so it took a, we just had to really like think about what Westchester was. It's definitely on there. And I'll Tom had the perfect people in mind to help direct the project. They floated the ice. That's what they Dick and Patty Alderson. Dick and Patty have been members of the Westchester community for decades. Patty founded the Westchester Community Foundation and both were instrumental in the coming Liberty development, as well as the development of Westchester Hospital. They've, they've done so much for this community and, and the, when one thinks of Westchester Liberty Township, one thinks of Patty and, and uh, Dick. So to be involved in creating, you know, the history here and, and the important aspects of, you know, what we remember as being residents here since 1972, which makes us old timers, uh, it's, it was fun and it was exciting. Just take a look. You may see your alma mater or a place you or your children play, but there are definitely lessons to learn on this wall, like the original purpose of the Voice of America. This was the centerpiece of the entire world during the Second War and the, those antennas were located in this region. Other lessons take a much closer look, like that of Dudley Farm, the land where Westchester Hospital now sits. That was a lesson Patty taught Tom personally. She said, where's the silo? When I first showed her the picture, and I said, the only thing I saw on the internet was some dented silo. And she said, Tom, that's so vital. That's such a landmark. It apparently in 1980, um, a tornado hit this area, and that happened to be the day that Ronald Reagan was shot. And it's those lessons Tom, Dick, and Patty, and the Westchester Hospital family hope to pass on through this work of art. I have a feeling that a lot of the maternity families will come in here and they're going to learn a couple things about their community. Grandparents can talk to um, their grandchildren about the history of this area. Um, we have people just stopping by off the street, stopping by and saying we want to see this mural. So it's been very positive. This reminds us how rich this community is. And anyone can come in to take a look at the mural. Just make your way to Westchester Hospital and ask to be directed to the maternity waiting room. For UC Health, I'm Christy Davis.